Okay, I've arrived. This is my little square. This is Vivizano. I just got a little coffee from here and it's a blue sky day and I'm in heaven. I'm literally in heaven right now. Okay, this is my house here. I'm being really quiet. This is, um, I think it's because it's like siesta time here. Well, but so you can have a little, I mean, how cute is my street? So here it is. Here's the whole of the house. I'm just gonna, not that one, sorry. This one. I'm about to go up on my big balcony. And that is the house on this side. And there's a car coming. And here is the side of the house. And again, I'm about to go up on my balcony because the sun has just come out. Okay. Hi. I made it to Italy. I've just done my first load of laundry. <laughs> so I'm gonna be very Italian right now. And like my neighbor over there, I'm gonna hang my laundry. As bizarre as this sounds, I'm actually really excited about it. Um, there were a couple issues with my electricity. So when I arrived, it was um, like the electricity was anytime I plugged in an appliance, it, um, anytime I plugged in an appliance, it shorted everything out. And that's because the past owners didn't pay their bill for the past four months or more than that, like the past four bills. I think I'm gonna have to buy some more of these, but I'm gonna hang, whoop, yep, definitely gonna have to buy. I mean, okay. So the hanging may not work. No, okay, so this is, so today, <laughs> okay, so these are all broken. Good one. So today, oh, today I'm going to go into the town and get some more clothespins. But in the meantime, I think I should be able to hang at least a shirt on there. It's not windy here. And I'll hang another shirt. So at least I've hung some laundry. But see what you find out? These are broken, whoa. And there we go. These are broken and I need to go to the shop. So the shops are basically closed until three o'clock. Everybody you know, goes home and has lunch, amazing. And takes a little pause. Um, there we go. Um, but you can see, so that's gonna be my big thing is, is going to buy clothespins today. <laughs> so I'm buying clothespins today and I'm getting a SIM card for my phone, so I'm gonna have an Italian phone number. I need it in order to set up my internet banking. But yeah, I just wanted to say hi, and I can't wait for you guys to come visit here and maybe hang your own clothes. And I promise you, if you do Airbnb this place, you will have all new clothes pins there. I gotta go get a dust, a dust uh, bin, um, dust, sorry dustpan and broom to go um, swipe this up. But lots to do, as you can see, but that's what makes it fun. And it's a project and I love it, love it, love it. Anyway, here's to going to get some clothespins. Bye. Okay, so here's my kitchen. I have this on a, on a tripod. I have the other like thing that, the gimbal that I'll take around as well. But I just thought, so I've just, opened up my window for the first time. So I'll show you what it looks like on the outside. And then, but I've opened it up. To, so it just lets in so much light, which is amazing. So a couple of things just to tell you, as you know, the electricity is now working. So I haven't been able to run a dishwasher since, which is fine, don't mind that. But like I bought new plates. Um, Steven will insert uh, the new plates and glasses and everything that I bought. So a couple of things that I've sort of just figured out is, well, A, the electricity is now working because the, all the past bills have been paid, hallelujah. But I did have to go to the post office and pay my bill, which was due February 25th. Um, and so that's all good, um, few, but that wasn't the reason why my electricity wasn't working. Even though mine was late, it was, um, theirs was like way late for like a whole year of electricity bills not being paid. Anyway, enough about that. So, 
So I'm gonna load up my dishwasher for the first time, which sounds crazy, but I'm super excited about it. Today, as you know, I'm gonna go get clothespins. It's like an exciting day. I'm gonna go get a SIM card for my phone so then I can, I have a bank account here so my internet banking can start. And there was something, oh yeah, super exciting. Here are my glass jars from my fungini, uh, sorry, uh, porcini, fungi porcini mushrooms. Um, apparently, uh, porcini mushrooms are like huge here, like massive. And these are um, beans. And so I need, I figured out that there's a place in Fivizano that I just drop them into. So that's like a trip. I gotta go drop them in, then I'm gonna go to, um, to get, uh, oh, I need dishwash. I have one dishwashing tablet. So I need, now that my dishwasher is working, I need to get that. It's a busy day. It's a busy day. Anyway, the other thing that I wanted to tell you about is this. So we're going to show you. So Malcolm, my amazing interior designer, um, incredible is helping me virtually uh, with this place. So I took like, and we'll show you some of these photos as well. In every room, I took like a gazillion photos. Malcolm was like, take all the, as many photos as you can, send them to me. And he did the design and then told me what areas in red that I need to measure. So that's, I'm going to start loading up the dishwasher right now. It's, um, 15 or 20 more minutes until it's three o'clock when things start to open up. And then I'm going to go make my trips. I mean, the simple life, I'll take it. I love it. Okay, anyway, so welcome to my kitchen, and hopefully, uh, if you visit here, you'll be uh, experiencing this kitchen when it gets redone. Remember, this is all being ch -ch -ch renovated. The most amazing antiques place. I mean, there's too much to show you on this video, but it is crazy, crazy amazing. This is just like literally a speck of what you're seeing right now. It's all outdoors, everything. I've already found some. All right, I've just bought a whole bunch of things for an unbelievable price. I just, I bought these chairs, 10 euros each. All, oh, this mirror I got is from Murano. I'm in the happiest, I mean, I just bought my, just basically bought furniture for my house. Okay, as promised, I'm gonna give you a little bit of a tour. So this is the side of my house. That's the window leading into the kitchen. That up there is the bathroom window. And so I just wanted to give you guys a little um, tour of the house. So you can see it here. And all the way up there is a bedroom window. That's the kitchen window. I've got my mask on. That is the sitting room window. That's another bedroom window, my terrace, there's my front door, and if I come around here, my neighbor is, yep, doing laundry, and then there's the side of my house, and here comes the postman. So there's another door leading to the side of my house, and that's to the hallway. So let's enter, shall we? Super fun. Okay, front door, original front door. So I've been here for just a little bit, not very long. So got to, let's see, switch on the lights. Okay, yep. Um, we're gonna come into the first room here. All right, so sitting room here. This is not my furniture, I'm gonna get rid of it. However, I did find these side tables at the market. So at the flea market, so these little side tables there, one of my purchases, you can see the original stone. We will be obviously keeping some of that, but not necessarily some of the designs. There's the other side table, so I love it. I wanted these, I don't know where I can use them, so you need to get them. These are my chairs, 10 euros each, got six of them. They're gonna go up on the terrace. Behind here is the mirror. So I did take a picture of this before they wrapped it up, the Murano glass mirror. And then these are the amazing sort of antique lights. Yeah, so antique, how cute, wall lights, right? So amazing, a, set, a pair of these 
And then this, I just loved, and they were like, un regalo, un regalo. I'm like, a gift, I'll take it. We like our tea, so I am a little bit of an Anglophile, and, um, or a lot. So that is the fantastic tea tray. So this is the sitting room. And then moving into the kitchen where we came from the outside, there's that huge window. And again, lots to do. I'm not gonna keep that table nor that desk, da da da. But it's a huge kitchen, which is great. Just bought all my cleaning supplies today. So there you can see cleaning supplies. I did get a coffee maker. Of course, they have good coffee here and I can just literally walk 30 seconds and get some good coffee as well. All of this is gonna be changed, the floor, the kitchen, everything but not these original steps. They are definitely going to stay. Then we're gonna move up here. So we're gonna, uh, this door is no longer gonna be a door because I don't really think we necessarily need two doors. Um, so this is going to be a, we're gonna make it into a window. So that's gonna be a window. Moving up the stairs and coming into, again, all the flooring is gonna be changed. That's a quick, quick peek into my bedroom. I'm not gonna give you too much. One second because it's private, but that's my bedroom. It is actually really, really big. I'm gonna show you how to open up these windows in a second. Turn off the lights. And we head down the hallway. So there's the hallway. Here is the second bedroom. Again, everything's gonna be changed. Oh yeah, the light bulb went out. It's like, welcome to Italy. So the light bulb went out. So use your imagination, but we'll get you a great picture of this original old door. How fantastic is that? And yes, I'm gonna open up the windows. I'm gonna show you how, cause I had to learn like, how do we open up these windows? Take it through here. This is an enormous bathroom. Whoop, so, okay. Sorry, I still don't even know how to use the lights. Nice one. So a really, really big bathroom. Yeah, doing some laundry there, enormous gonna change all that so that's gonna be we're gonna put a bath in here and then we're gonna break through this wall and you'll see why we're gonna break through that wall to go into the other bathroom and so that big bathroom there is gonna have a bath I have to have a bath and it's also gonna have a shower so that's where the shower is gonna be we're gonna break through and then this will be storage here we'll put up a wall here so the bathroom will be big with a shower and a proper bath, of course, Lou. This is gonna be where the storage area. So I could put linens, mops, da da da, all that stuff, because I need some storage. Then heading down here, back across, let's open up a window. Okay, super fun. It's like my, my I saved this for you guys. Okay, open it up now. Open it up, okay? So watch. So these, they don't open. These do not open here, they don't open. So you gotta go, you gotta open that up. And then this little thing here on the side, yeah, there, hook it in. And then I can see my neighbor's amazing laundry hanging there. It's like everything, I'm all about the laundry. I'm all about hanging laundry. Let's do it with the other one, yep. Okay, a little bit tricky. Uh-huh, because I'm trying to do it with one hand, everybody. So it's, okay. Okay, maybe we'll get through that for later. Here, there we go, I got it. It's really hard with one hand. Okay, fantastic. Heading up now. So I'm not sure what we're gonna do with this. Whoops. Uh, Malcolm is gonna let me know. Heading up to the greatest, just the best. Oh, and it is my view and my big terrace. Okay, so here's my terrace. It's big, it's hot today. Hot, hot, hot. There's that other chair. Yep, so there we're gonna have a table and chairs up here. And it's super big. There's the church. Oh my gosh, I can't wait. And then these are my clothespins. Look at this. This has made my day, these clothespins. And it's made my week. It's made everything. But look at my view from all kind of four sides, if you like. I couldn't be happier. And the bell's ringing make me even happier. So I love it here. I hope you guys will all come and stay because I will be airbnb it out and you can walk everywhere. You can walk to the piazza. You can walk, you walk everywhere. Well, I mean, within the town. Um, anyway, this is my new house and super, I'm just unbelievably excited about it. All right, I'm 
showing you guys my terrace and what I do every single morning <laughs> is I go to my local coffee shop, get my little um, double espresso. I do it, I can say it, un doppio espresso con taco caldo sopra. They know now Americano, but I still like saying it. And then I get to sit out here on my terrace and I get to, yeah, look at that. There's the church spire. And I get to drink my coffee and eat my croissant. Although it's un cornetto. Un cornetto con marmalata. Mm, Dao journal, Sundays. Ma not all. Uh, non, um, come si dice? Uh, oh, non tutti journal. Journey, non tutti journey. Anyway, okay, I'm still learning, right? I still have my lesson three times a week. And then of course, right there. Mm -hmm wooden clothespins, found those. The most exciting day of my life was when I found those. I've, I can't, I'm gonna write a book on the metaphor of clothespins and what it means to me right now. Anyway, there's my view and my coffee's behind me. See if you can see that. There we go, no, the other way. It's my gimbal. There it is, there's my coffee, my chair, and me, I'm about to go there. And there's, a, there's my un cornetto con marmalata. Um, in the bag, which would be nella borsa, but I think that means purse. So, sachet, uh, I think it's sacato. Okay, I'll get back to you on that one, but still, work in progress. Okay, I'm gonna leave you so my coffee doesn't get too cold. But um, hopefully, uh, yeah, you can come and see this for yourself. <laughs>